Welcome back guys to another episode of GTA 5 Story Mode. So I'm gonna be meeting Solomon Richard. Oh come on man. Could at least break. So how can I get to meet him? I can't even climb over. I think it's the other way around, I'm not really sure. Let me check. Oh, I guess it is. Hi, I'm Sue Murray, and I want to be your next governor. I know how to lead from the front. I used to be a Yeah. Alright, let's meet him. Come in, come in. Thanks. You must be Michael. Yeah. You know, I used to have three secretaries. Now I have to make my own coffee and give myself a happy ending. <laughs> See, the ships are coming in. But the walls will hold us. Nelson in Naples. Pluto? I said Mars, you cocksucker. <laughs> Shoulder of Orion. Two. Devin Weston said you were a fan. Huge fan. Tell me, Michael. Devin Weston, did he... Does he want you to bump me off? No, not at all. He said you were retiring but might need some help on a movie. Only assholes retire, Michael. Him and my son, they want to put me out to pasture so they can turn this place into condos or a theme park or something. But this place is a dream factory. Well, maybe they have different dreams. Some days, I don't blame them. You know, they always say, never work with children or animals. Well, I want to add to that list. Never work with directors or actors. This picture is going to kill me. All right. So what's it about? It's perfect. Set in Liberty City. Meltdown. <laughs> it's all being shot on green screen right out back there. We take a look at the financial crisis, and then we boil it all down into a really simplistic battle between two yuppies. Lots of training montages. So what's the problem? Milton McElroy. I cast him in the second lead because he's cheap. Zero talent, incidentally. Well, he's got this new agent, Rocco Pelosi. He's been hassling us about renegotiating the deal. So now, He's holding up shooting until he gets paid. That sounds problematic. It would be if the director wanted to shoot. Anton Baudelaire. Ever heard of him? That doesn't surprise me. Now he's having a mental breakdown, pissing all over himself who knows where. <sighs> all right. Looks like you got yourself that new assistant. Oh, you're working for Solomon now. No happy endings. <laughs> I love you already. <laughs> Go to East Los Santos. Okay, take the car then. Oh, there's a helicopter. There he is. Gentlemen, how you like this space? It's gonna be an EDM paradise. There's gonna be sparklers stuck in bottles, implants, tramp stamps, all the real shit. That's Pelosi Entertainment. Now give me a minute here, just a minute. I gotta go grab something inside. Yanni, we nearly got the club. We're finally a go. Now you take care of these guys. No cold feet. Okay? Let's go. Oh, seriously? How can I do that? Because I don't know how. At least I can climb. 
Are there any ladder? Well, here is the ladder. Oh, the two guards are here. One guard is right here. Somewhere down there. All we do is move some weight out of the back room. Yeah, the two workers, which mean he's inside. Oh, flip, I can't go through this way. Which way can I go then? Is it somewhere higher? I'm pretty sure it is. Right. Come on, be quick, 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 quick. Oh, it's close. Alright, we have arrived at the helipad. Oh, you're gonna fight him? Okay. Is that all he got? Just a punch and a kick, nothing else? Done. He's gone. Is that it? Let's get back to the lot. Oh, now I have to fly a helicopter again. Okay. I forgot how to fly. I don't know who you think you are. Look, you can bully him, but you can't bully Talent, buddy. We are not shooting until I get a new deal. Can't bully Talent? Just watch me. You're gonna be a good boy when I'm done. I don't know who you think you are. Jumped up to studio security? I ain't security. I'm Solomon's assistant. You're serious. And let's talk. Honest to honest. Oh, oh don't break yet. Oh, close. Oh, wrong timing, wrong time. There we go. Oh, come on, then. Yeah, yeah, thank you. Done. 
Solomon's office. Come on. Oh. How about I call my guy, go on a little jolly, and call Solomon from wherever I wake up in, in a week. How about you see him right now? Ah, ah, what a wonderful surprise. Anton, my boy, you're an artist, I know that. And this story is the best kind of art. A simplistic, cliche-ridden pile of dross that you will turn into magic. Get a grip, I love ya. So Solomon. Milton here has a little something he wants to say to you. Say it. Uh, I, I just, just want to say that I'm sorry for any misunderstanding, sir. And I, I appreciate all the opportunities that, that, that you've given me. Of course, of course. Michael, what can I say? You're a natural. I love you. Well, you're too kind. No, no, I mean it. I don't mean to presume. But would it be okay if I gave you a shout? This shoot seems cursed for some reason or another. I need an associate producer. I'd love that. We'll talk soon. I gotta go. Oh, hell yeah. He's now an associate producer. <laughs> oh, very nice of him. Oh, we're gonna be meeting Devin now. All I need is a car. Oh, American Muscle, let's take that then. There he is. With Franklin and Clever. Mm, what's going on? You're gonna dress up as traffic cops and you're gonna rob two trust fund kids that I know and dislike intensely. Uh, why? We can get a good price for the vehicles in Asia. Look, complete the work, you'll all be well paid. You're late, sugar tits. Yep. So what's going on? Oh, oh, oh you finally get to realize your childhood dream and dress up as a cop. Mr. Weston's research team suggests the two boys like to ride on the Sonora Freeway. Sounds manageable. Hey, you two get going. Ooh, let's go, T. Dog, I don't know if this shit is for me, homie. My life's already way the fuck out of control. All right, look. I'm a Darwinist brother, all right? Some prosper and some struggle. Now, are you out of your goddamn mind? This is your lucky break. Choose! Now, are you gonna do this, or have you simply found your level in life? I guess we'll find out. Yeah, I guess we will, homie. That's an eye, Bugatti. In the wrong way. He just up there. Oh, that's a nice car, aren't they? How about we see which one of you two is for real? So get in your cars and let's see if they move as fast as your mom. Ooh, the fool wants to race us. We were just getting out of here anyway. Right. Seriously, I'm gonna race him with that. Race the cars. How am I supposed to race the car? Because I don't know exactly where to go now. Come on, man. Can I not see where I have to go? I don't need it. How on earth are they speeding up?
Oh, come on, catch up. Oh, get out of my way, man. That's cheating. Oh, there we go. Come on, then I can do this. Hey, we're coming up now, man. Beat it in a few seconds. Got it. Whatever. Here it comes. I'll tell you about that later. Oh, almost lock and fall. Now we're chasing them. How far are they, man? They're too far. Bro, I can't even get him. Oh, that was close. Here's Franklin, but the other two is too fast. Okay, they are slowing down. They're not going to stop at all. Are they? Oh, nice. They get it. Oh, now we're stealing them two cars. Alright, we stole the car now. Drive a car, get a garage. Let's go, hurry up. Five miles away, you're kidding me. Done.
Oh, we have to use a helicopter again? <laughs> oh, we just completed this mission. <laughs> anyway, guys, I'm gonna end the video here. If you guys enjoyed it, please subscribe to the channel. And I will see you guys in the next video.